What is going on, everybody? Welcome back. Today we're checking out wa Wanders. Wanders. The words are stupid. I can't make them work. We're checking out a game called Wonderful, uh, which is an indie game. This is only a demo. The game will be coming out very soon. Uh, can we actually buy the game right now? Or is it... It's... Yeah, at your wish list. Right, 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 right. So it's not available yet. But with that said, we're going to check it out. Uh, name your island. Name your adventure. Your great story has even greater name what's yours this will define how the world is generated which is a little bit weird but let's just name it uh epic journey why not epic journey oh look there's uh ethereal echoes sparks of hope let's do sparks of hope although i think that's a mario brothers game still begin our journey now i had mentioned in our first video this is very reminiscent of a little game called islanders in my opinion Okay, I, I forgot you have to click this first. Okay, this is our Ember Trail. Let's make it work for us the best way that we can. Meh, meh. We'll do that. And all you're trying to do here is get a high score. Now, with every tile that you move, you will lose an Ember in your Lantern. And it's your job to expand the land as far as you can and continue living and surviving. Now, the demo says it's only got three days. I don't think we're going to make it that far. But with that said, we can still try. Let's do a snack kiosk. And each thing has its own little description here. Shows its true potential when placed next to a farm. Uh, snack kiosk placed on any ground. These machines expand your journey wherever it is necessary. So we're going to use this. And we're going to keep on expanding the best way that we can. That looks pretty good. We'll move over here. Try to get some more land. And basically, you're trying to make the best moves for your situation so we're doing all right here we're gonna need a ladder here a little ramp oh come on can we make that can we make that happen uh i'm not sure i like that but we'll do a field here maybe yeah we can make that happen like this that we can come get this ember. Nice. I'll get a farmstead and put that around here. These are best if you can put them around an area. So we're going to do that. Hopefully we can make it over here. Fields. Alright, I think we're starting to get the hang of this. Ooh, what's this? Lodge expands these burning houses are typical for the commons. Okay, we got a lodge down here now. These things can only be placed in certain areas, right? So you can't place them over here, for example. I guess the commons are by the water, so that's where we're gonna put that. Let's see, where's the front? I'm not sure what the front of this is. We'll say it's this way. That does not look right to me, but we're down to 15, 14. We're gonna do another lodge. We'll, oh no, okay, stop moving. Let's come over here and get this guy real quick. A tower, what a sight. This high building expands your path quite a bit and lets you explore new areas. Let's do that. Now you don't ever really wanna go backwards because that's gonna be a waste of your ember, which could end your life. So we definitely don't want that. But maybe let's come over here and try to get this guy over here. Now we do have a tower. Let's place that. That's actually perfect. Uh, here's another tower. Nice. Come over here and grab this guy. Ooh, what's this? Turn. Perfect if you changed your mind and want to explore a different section of Relict of the Commons. Okay. We'll try that out. We'll put another tower here. Oh, what's this? Station. For those who only have one direction forward. An old station of the commons. Alright. Well, I guess we're just going forward. Let's use that. Oh, that's nice, actually. Hell yeah. We do need some stairs coming up pretty soon. 
Should definitely use that if possible. Lodge. We'll place the lodge right around here. I want to see if we can get this, but I'm not sure we can. Days till demo end, so you'll only get up to three days to survive. But we're doing pretty good right now, so that's good. Uh, let's do... Alright, so we're going to come here, we're going to grab this. We'll do that, but can we use this turn? Oh, that's almost perfect. There you go, we can do that. Actually, this might not have been such a good idea, realistically. Uh, let's see, crossing, okay, that's actually gonna help us out. We do this right here. Station, that's really gonna help. We'll do, we'll put a station here, like that, and we'll put a crossing here. Oh, that actually works out very nice. Can I not move? What's happening here? Why can I not? over here put that cross and ride there I don't know if we want to go back because this is basically the beginning where we started over here so we're actually not gonna go that way uh, I probably should have thought of that beforehand that's not gonna help us out at all so we're just gonna come up here and grab that now, if you start to run out of embers in your lantern, you can get rid of these by pressing the right click, and that'll give you more embers. Fertilizer, flower patch. Let's do a flower patch. Oof. Oh no, I don't... Oh no. I messed up. No, no, no. Hold on. I, I can... No, that's still not going to work. Oh no, guys, I think I ruined it. Okay, we are going to have to go back. Because there's nothing for me to expand here because I can't get an ember. And we are fixing to run out of life. Turn. Do that. Come over here and grab this. A lodge. We'll put a lodge here, maybe. That's still not... There you go. We'll do that. Put this turn up here. I think we may be screwing this up, but let's continue forward, I guess. We're so close to running out of life right now. Oh. We might not survive much longer than this, guys. Give me a station. Please let me make it this far. I'm not sure if we will. Whoa, that was super close. Let's use the tower. It is actually challenging because you really do need to look at what you're doing and where you're going before you can do anything else. The issue is that we don't have any embers to collect here. There's one right there, but you really got to be planning for it. Because if not, it's just not going to work. We're not going to be able to make it up there either way. Because the woods are in the way. Oh my goodness. Can we make that work? Oh. Oh, I think we're going to lose it. Oh, we actually survived. We survived all three days. That's not bad. 
Now, of course, whenever you get the game, you're going to have to keep going as far as you can for as many days as you can. But we did okay. We survived all three days. And so ends the tale of Sparks of Hope. We got 4,800. We uncovered 222. Got 22 embers. There's a lot of twos there. Survived for three days. Made four or got to four bonfires. It's not bad. It's a really relaxing game. Wanted to share it with you guys. The thing that attracted me to this was simply the art style. I love it when indie games are not afraid to play with colors and pastels and stuff like that. I'll definitely be picking this game up. It's very chill. Just wanted to share it with you guys. Let me know what you think in the comments and I will see you on the next video.